Hello everyone, I'm Case Muse. And I'm Bradley Lee. And we're your experts from Metro Realty. And today we're bringing to you the first quarter market update for 2017. Just before we go through the start of this year, I just wanted to recap on 2016 because it was a really phenomenal year in the Dunedin real estate market. We were seeing some fantastic prices for properties and the, prof the houses were selling in record time as well. Case, do you want to tell us about some of the statistics? Yeah, so for that last quarter of uh, 2016, there was an average days on the market of about 23. Uh, also, there were probably about 100, uh, sorry, 269 houses on the market. And the average house price went from uh, 305 in 2015 to the end of 2016 at 325,000. So as you can see, it was a really, really good, good end of the year. Um, we also had a fantastic sale, or well, actually Case had a fantastic sale down on Highgate. Do you want to maybe tell us a bit about that and how that yeah. went? Yeah, so we had this property, um, it was a really good family home, had lots of options. We ended up doing a two week deadline on that. We got several groups through and we ended up presenting uh, three cash offers to the vendor, which we thought the property would end up in the mid fives and it exceeded that, finished up in the 600s was a fantastic result for your client, wasn't it? Oh, okay. They were so happy, they were over the moon, they couldn't believe it, but that's the market at the moment. Anything of quality that is out there, there is buy demand for it. So off the back of 2016, our 2017 year has been also incredible. We've had a, a huge increase in demand from buyers out there, and also the, the amount of properties on the market is still really, really low. So whenever anything that is good comes onto the market, there is huge buy demand. Yeah, and I think it's really just shown with the statistics, you know, the average house price, sorry, the median house price in January 2016 was 310000 where this year it's jumped all the way to 350, which is a huge jump that is for, huge, the, you know, for the Dunedin market. Great for the vendors out there as well. I think um, a great example of where the prices have changed is this property I sold in um, Silverton Street. We had about 100 buyers through on a two week deadline, sold for a fantastic price, miles above the rental value. Um, again, my client was absolutely ecstatic with the result. So Brad, with all this demand and all the houses that have been selling really quick on the market, what sort of method are we using to sell those properties and get really good results? Well, at the moment, in my, my, my opinion, there's really only two ways to sell a property at the moment. Um, and it's either deadline sale or auction. The reason for that is the market's just so strong at the moment. And if you were to put a price on your house, I think you're just really shooting yourself in the foot. Because as we all know, as soon as you price a property, buyers are gonna come in under trying to get you down in price where if we leave no price on the property, we do an extensive campaign for two weeks. It allows us to try and negotiate upwards with the price and get our clients a really premium price. You, you Definitely, I agree. The other flip side to that is the, the auction option, which is, is, is similar to a deadline sale, but it is on one certain day where, where all the action happens. We, get, we advertise the property, we get the people through, then they come in. It is a little bit more public, but it is a lot of fun for both buyers and vendors as well. And I think you'd agree, Case, that um, the way we sell property is we're not in the business of selling it to the first buyer when that comes along. We really want to market your house properly for the first couple of weeks, create some competition in the market and just try and get your price that, you know, that well exceeds your expectations. So just to recap on the beginning of 2017, we believe that it's still going really strong and that the next quarter is going to be just as strong. Definitely, Case, I think there's going to be strong demand over the next quarter. So if you do have any questions about the Dunedin real estate market, feel free to give Case a call or myself.